The next five brain yoga exercises that I'm going to show you are great when you feel that your child is getting tired and needs a little bit of movement to be able to refocus. After I show you the exercises, I'll tell you what the benefits are of doing these activities with your multilingual children. So let's get started. Super brain yoga is what the first brain activity is commonly known for. It's a simple exercise that is believed to improve cognitive function, memory and overall brain health, which is exactly what our multilingual children need to be able to learn various languages effectively. As you might have noticed, it involves crossing the midline of the body by touching specific points on the earlobes while performing squats and breathing. The benefits of doing super brain yoga and other brain gym activities with children can be numerous. I say can be because there is still limited scientific research on this field to support the actual effectiveness of each exercise. Nevertheless, they can be fun and engaging activities to do with your bilingual or multilingual children. It can't hurt and it's likely to have potential cognitive and behavioral benefits. So there's nothing to lose, therefore give it a try and check out my other videos for more practical brain gym activities. Some of the potential benefits are improved focus and concentration. These activities can help children stay engaged for longer periods of time. That is exactly what they need to become good learners, right? 
Brain yoga can also enhance memory, retention and recall, which can be particularly helpful for academic learning and specifically for language learning. That's why I'm showing you this. Why? Because your children, our children, need to learn tons and tons of vocabulary words. So having a good memory is essential. In addition, physical activities in general are known to reduce stress and anxiety. The activities that I just showed you before have a calming effect on the nervous system. My daughter, for example, sometimes has trouble sleeping. I've noticed that these exercises help her fall asleep faster when she does them before going to bed. So brain yoga can also help children with behavior and self-regulation. Daily practice may improve, for example, impulse control and emotional regulation in children. So if your child has, for example, ADHD or any other learning disabilities or difficulties, these exercises can help. Try them out and let me know which one you like the most in the comments. And if you're not subscribed yet, consider doing so to get more help and support in raising successful multilingual children. In these two other videos that you see here, I show you more brain gym exercises. Have fun and see you next time.